Well, it's been a week since the Harrison County fatal plane crash that claimed the lives of the pilot and three others. The National Transportation Safety Board has released the preliminary crash information, but earlier this week, a seasoned pilot and certified flight instructor spoke to CBS 19 about the details of the crash and what concerned him specifically regarding the pilot's qualifications. Our Peyton Weidman explains. Uh, if a pilot is not qualified, or proficient to operate an airplane uh, under the conditions of a particular flight, then uh, that pilot is creating a, a hazard. Robert Katz is a commercial pilot and certified flight instructor in Dallas who's been flying for 38 years. Well, uh, once the pilot's name was identified, I used the public portal provided by the Federal Aviation Administration to look at his credentials. It was a flight from Dallas to New Orleans that never made it. Last Saturday, this private plane crashed in Harrison County near Longview. The pilot, William Robert Kendrick, as well as his three passengers, did not survive the crash. The NTSB's preliminary report details the alleged events that led up to the accident. Well, the NTSB uh, has their protocol that they have to follow. It's very comprehensive. Uh, and what I discovered was three anomalies that uh, affect public safety very seriously. According to NTSB, the plane was destroyed when it collided with trees and terrain during a descent near the crash site. But after reviewing the pilot's credentials, Kat says Kendrick should not have been flying this specific plane at this particular time in the first place. Number one, uh, it appears that his medical certificate was either suspended or revoked, and uh, meaning that he would have absolutely no privilege to operate any airplane under any circumstances. The report states Kendrick's last medical exam was dated August 8, 2018, and initial information from the Federal Aviation Administration says he had a private pilot certificate for a single engine plane, but the airplane involved in the crash was a twin engine. Uh, secondly, um, he, he did not possess a multi-engine rating which would be required for the type of airplane involved in this incident. The NTSB lists some of the recorded weather during the morning of the crash as scattered clouds, light thunderstorms and rain. Uh, and lastly, he did not have an instrument airplane rating, which is a separate standalone privilege required to take an aircraft into uh, weather other than clear skies. Kat says this is important because weather is a suspected factor in the cause of the accident leading me to believe that this pilot became disoriented uh, in flight and uh, the end would have been very ugly for everyone on board. NTSB says the plane's engines did not show any damage that could not be linked to impact from hitting the ground, but they want to emphasize that this is all preliminary information. In Harrison County, Peyton Weidman, CBS 19. A final report by the NTSB should come out in about a year. 